rejoice heartily in the Lord, and my God is the joy of my soul. He has clothed me with a robe of salvation, and wrapped me in the mantle of justice, like a bride adorned with jewels. O God, who by the second conception of the Blessed Virgin, prepared a worthy dwelling for your Son. Grant, we pray, that as you have preserved her from every sin by virtue of the death of your Son, which you foresaw so through her intercession, we too may be cleansed and admitted to your presence. Through the Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. First reading, Genesis 3. After Adam had eaten of the tree, the Lord called him, Where are you? he asked. I heard the sound of you in the garden, he replied. I was afraid I was naked, so I hid. Who told you that you were naked? he asked. Have you been eating of the tree? I forbade you to eat. The man replied, It was the woman you put with me. She gave me the fruit, and I ate it. Then the Lord God asked the woman, What is this you have done? The woman replied, The serpent tempted me, and I ate. Then the Lord God said to the serpent, Because you have done this, you are cursed beyond all cattle, all wild beasts. You shall crawl on your belly and eat dust every day of your life. I will make you enemies of each other, you and the woman, your offspring and her offspring. It will crush your head and you will strike its heel. The man named his wife Eve because she was the mother of all those who live. The word of the Lord. Thank be to God. Psalms 97. Sing a new song to the Lord, for he has worked wonders. Sing a new song to the Lord, for he has worked wonders. His right hand and his holy arm have brought salvation. The Lord has made known his salvation, has shown his justice to the nations. He has remembered his truth and love for the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God. Shout to the Lord, all the earth, ring out your joy. <sighs> Blessed be God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with all the spiritual blessings of heaven in Christ. Before the world was made, he chose us, he chose us in Christ to be holy and spotless and to live through love in his presence, determining that we should become his adopted sons through Jesus Christ for his own kind purposes to make us praise the glory of his grace, his free gift to us in the beloved. And it is in him that we were claimed as God's own, chosen from the beginning under the predetermined